Hey guys, welcome back to Clock to Creations tutorials for plushie making. We're back with another video which is based off of the Gundam plushie I did and this is another really really quick and easy one. A lot of people have asked me how to make piercings for my plushies um, and it's surprisingly easier than you think. So for this earring that Gundam has, it's a dangly earring, it's not a stud. So to start off with you need some wire and you need some pliers. So the size of wire really really depends on you. I used quite thin wire, I'm afraid I don't know the diameter of it because it was one that I got from college many years ago, so that's just what I'm using. The other stuff was thick wire that I had at the beginning and that was what I used for my Aizawa scarf and that was too thick and I don't recommend using something that thick. It's not as easy to manoeuvre and bend and it's not going to be easy to get through your fabric. What I start off doing is I start by measuring the amount of wire I want, hold it up against the ear and see how long you want the earring to be and cut the wire with your pliers and bend it into a loop shape until you're happy with that shape. Gundam has like a little bead on his earring, so I've just got some beads, I got them from Wilco's, uh, they were like a pound for loads. Absolutely easy to get hold of, so if you want any decorations like that, there's plenty of things on eBay and in the shops and things. Then once you've got your little earring, you just need to take an unpicker. If you don't have one, they should be fairly easy to get hold of. They'll be in any sewing shop you ever come across. That I, I even see them in my supermarkets um, in the UK. And basically you're gonna use this unpicker as your piercer. So you just need to essentially pierce a hole through Gundam's ear. What I like to do with it is you just poke it through the fabric and wiggle it about a bit, sort of drag it downwards a little bit try and be very very gentle and careful if you go too heavy-handed you'll rip a massive tear in your fabric so you need to be very gentle and careful with it and once you've got a hole big enough you just slot the wire on through Once you've got the wire through, you just use the pliers again to bend the wire downwards so that the wire won't go falling back through your little piercing hole. And there you have it, you have like a cute little earring that's just simple and effective. And if you really like giving your plushies detail like this, it's just so fun to do. And I think it definitely fits Gundam very, very well. If you wanted to do a stud, there are these things that I used, um, I can't remember what they're called, I think they're called snap fixers, I think that's what they were called. If you look at my plushie hospital, you can see me using them for Gadriel's studs on his face, um, but they basically, they clip together through the fabric and they make like little studs, you can get them for earrings, for lip piercings. There's always resin that you can use to hot glue onto the studs to, to glue on a little pattern, a design onto your little snap fixers. Um, so I hope you found this video helpful. If you do have any questions, do let me know in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.